Hello everyone, my name is Mark Hanchett. I'm the founder and CEO here at Atlas Motor Vehicles, and this is gonna be our weekly update. Uh, this week on the energy business, we've got the first cell that came off the pilot production line in dry room V1. That's now going into formation. So over the next couple of weeks, we'll start sharing some test results and validation results on that first cell that came off. Remember, we're targeting cells delivered to customers towards the end of this month. So it's very important that when we get that first cell built, we start building additional cells and get some of those validation results in so we can fix any problems we have before we ship those first, cust or first cells to customers towards the end of this month. Still on track to do that. In Q1 and Q2 over the next year, we're gonna be focused on growth. So while V1 dry room is functioning, V2 is under construction. We're hoping to get that built up and completed towards the end of this quarter. And then of course in Q1 and Q2, we'll focus on getting some of that equipment in there as we look to scale to hundreds of cells that we can produce hopefully per day. And of course in 2022, we're targeting a $300 million opportunity in the energy business. That means roughly about 3 million cells that Atlas has to build next year or by the end of next year. So lots of scale happening, lots of team growth happening as well. So we're growing about 10% per week. We've got a lot of open opportunities out there. So if you're a mechanical engineer, electrical, hardware, power electronics, software, and firmware engineer, lots of openings there, lots of opportunity to work on very cool, new, innovative products in the energy space, as well as the XT and XP products as we look to launch those towards the end of 2022. And that's gonna be our weekly update.